severe weather preparedness week in Mississippi and in this part of the state, it's also approaching the anniversary of several powerful tornadoes. One of those was a fatal EF2 that ripped through Hamilton nearly a year ago. The storm caused major damage. Our Quentin Smith finds out that it also helped build new bonds in the community. He joins us live in the studio with that story. And yeah, that's right, Scott. After the storm hit, an organization called Monroe Strong was formed. It's a committee that was designed to help residents and those in the community get the resources they need to get back on their feet. Those I spoke with today say the storm brought the best out of everyone because everyone had to lean on one another to get through this tough time. Damaged homes, uprooted trees, and pure devastation. This is drone footage of the aftermath from the April tornado that struck Hamilton in 2019. Pastor Robert Moore remembers the destruction, but he also remembers the unity and how the community came together as one. We knew all along what we would do in a case like that because that's the kind of community it is. It's a community where everybody basically knows one another and uh, tries to take care of one another. So uh, it wasn't a question about what we're going to do. They, they just did it. Seeing the community come together was a bright spot during a dark time. Emily Kennedy helped with the organization Monroe Strong during the recovery efforts. She says Hamilton has always been a close-knit community, and after the storm, it helped everyone grow even closer. In that moment of fear, it brought people together to say, you know what, it's going to be okay. When one person lost a house and the other one's lost a house, that common denominator brings them together. You know what, together, we're going to be okay. Kennedy is also the first lady at Abundant Life UPC, one of many churches that opened its doors to give back to storm survivors. She says she witnessed several acts of kindness as the community was recovering from the storm. It just makes me emotional to think about I, I've never seen so much love from humankind to another humankind because of the love and support. We're talking people of, of every race, people of every stature. You know, you've seen, you seen them just reach out a hand and hug and give. While the residents were going through tough and difficult times, came about the hashtags Hamilton Strong and Monroe Strong, popular sayings symbolizing what the community is all about. In the night uh, before the morning, the next morning, they were out there with chainsaws and, and things like that, uh, doing what they needed to do just immediately after the storm. So uh, it's, uh, you talk about uh, biological families, church families, and community families, it's actually a community family. And another act of kindness being shown is through Kennedy's pottery collection. She created more than a dozen handmade platters and personalized each one in its own unique way for storm survivors in Hamilton. Scott.